No, and she kept trying to get him away, and I went like this, and she still tried to get him, and he told her to go away. <laughs> All right. Can I, can I get your name, please? My name is Sue. Hi, Sue. And that's good enough, right? Okay, yeah, that's fine, yeah. yeah well, and you were just talking with Ralph Goodale about what? We were talking to him about the... Um, Immigration detainees out east who are on a hunger strike, and their demand is to meet with Ralph Goodell. Okay. And it, where in east, like in Ottawa, or where are they out east? Somewhere out east. They're yeah, they're maybe Kingston, or they're somewhere in that southern Ontario. Yeah, okay. they're somewhere in, in Ontario. It might be on that thing. I don't. So even a know. hunger strike, I haven't heard of yet. Okay. <laughs> I think it's in Kingston. Yeah, I think it's in Kingston. I don't know wherever they have an immigration detainee. Okay. And people have been in there for years, no charges. Really? That's awful. Not deported home, not led back into Canada. 289 children are there. That's like the Australian detainee facilities that yeah. we're hearing about. Yeah, 289 children, a lot of them born there. Wow. And they're on a hunger strike just asking to meet with Ralph. And all we heard was all the policy changes he's going to make. And the policy changes are more important than him going there. And I reminded him that all they want is to talk to him. And then they'll break the hunger strike. And I reminded him that a lot of people have trusted him. And that's what they want to hear. Everything you're telling us, they want to hear it themselves. Go break bread with them and help them. So there seems to be break. some issue with a minister meeting with them and, and lending them either legitimacy or attention that they don't want to don't uh, maybe allow for. I don't know, because he kept going back to policy change. Something is going to be done about it. Yes, it's horrible what's happened to children. He's been saying for years that shouldn't happen. They inherit, inherited bad policy, which is true, and it's hard to get the policy down. And a lot of it has to stop. But he never would say that he would go in. And if they trust me, they can trust my staff. And I said, they don't know that. Maybe you can Skype in and tell them the same thing. They want to hear from you. The trust is with you. So that's where it was left. All right. Thanks for the information. And he, he says he's going to come by our colonialism no more. On Albert so we'll Street. See. Yeah, we'll see. All right. Well, yeah, let me know if he does. Oh, I <laughs> sure he's will. been there a few times, and he couldn't 